Hey guys, how team here too. We're gonna take a look at the new YouTube app version 5.0. Let's check it out. Alright, so it's rolling out for all Android devices and it looks very clean, elegant, and smooth. Oh, by the way, do not ask about my layout. I will be making a what's on my Android phone. So if you ask me anything about my uh, home screen or anything else, then I will not answer that question. Here we go, going into the app. It's actually the new YouTube app. You can see the icon has changed automatically. Opening it right up. Here you can see a white look to it. It's very fast, very smooth. You can see I scroll right through and it's very nice and clean. The videos load up quickly and the videos are smooth at scrolling. You can go in here, slide your finger and it pops up the YouTube menu and you can actually have your YouTube name. You can have the uploads, history, favorites, playlists, watch later, all your subscriptions down here. And obviously, all the way at the bottom, you have your trending, all your YouTube categories, and all your recommended. Very nice. You can also have that basic option where you can search up anything you want, and it pops up with all the videos. So we're just going to open up Techno Buffalo. Hopefully, it doesn't sue me. Here, you can see that animation that you saw right then and there. It looks very nice and clean. The new features that I found that were different is the fact that you have those thumbs up and thumbs down. You don't have to actually open the menu to do that anymore. You can subscribe to them automatically then and there. It's a separate section. Down here you have your suggestions and your comments as well. If we go landscape mode, you can check it out. They also included this button so you can make it automatically. Here I can tap on it and it pops it up right then and there. Play it. And you can see it looks very nice, clean, HD. Tap on it and it pops up with all your options. This is a new feature for the YouTube app. It looks great. It's this arrow key. You tap on it and automatically it pops up like a window, having that multi-view when you're scrolling right through the YouTube video. You can't have it over any app. Sadly, it's only for the YouTube app. And then when you're done watching, you can swipe it away just like that. Up at the top, you also have this add button so to add it to watch later, the added it inside the video. You can share it as well right then there inside the video. And you have that Chromecast or that Google TV now. And they actually changed the HD option. It's actually up here now in the menu and you can change it to CC or HD. Whatever you want, whatever is great for you. And like I said before, if you want it, here you can swipe it away. 5.0.21. I'll have a link down in the description so you can download it or you can wait for the update to come to your device. You do not need root to actually install the link in the description. But hope you guys like it. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. I will be coming out with the what's on my phone application. I won't be showing you any other screens or my lock screen because I don't want to spoil anything. But if you follow me on Facebook, I actually posted a picture of my home screen and it looks very nice. You can't get this anywhere else, by the way. I have actually created it myself, so you can't install it from the place or anything, sadly, but I'll show you how to get it soon. All right, so subscribe, keep watching, and share with your friends, and I will see you guys in the next video. Kapow!